Hello YouTube, today I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to get Windows 7 Home Premium 32-bit for free. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is click on the download link I have in the description. It's going to look just like this. Just give me right here. It's going to look just like this, okay? But before you can get to that, you're going to want to go here and download this thing called WinRAR, which the download link will be in the description as well. So I'm just going to show you how this works. I'm just going to pick a random file. Let's just say we're going to do this file, okay? So you're just going to hit extract to OK. I'm going to click yes, y'all. You probably won't have to. You're just going to wait for it to finish. So it finished. And then you're just going to go down here and search the application Windows. 7 Home Premium, which is right there. You're going to want to click on that, which I already have it open right here. It's going to pop up with this. It's going to go through the installation process. But before it hits installation, it's going to go to this thing called System Requirements. And it's going to see if your system meets the requirements for it. So the reason I made this video is because people like me was stuck with Vista, which Vista is a terrible system. I cannot stand it. And there are other people out there with XP that have problems with it too, and they just want a cleaner, stronger OS, which Windows 7 is amazing. Now, most people will think, okay, I'm going to download this and get a free Windows 10 ticket before June. Well, that's not exactly true, because I'm going to show you this right here. Over here, let's go to control panel. We're going to go to um, system and security system. As you can see, this is not a valid Windows key. So what, what this download is, is an ISO file, which is the system OS download. But this right here is not the valid product key, so you're going to have to use the 30-day trial and most people are like okay what do I do when I end the 30-day trial well you do get that black screen if you do not do what I'm about to show you but if you do not do what I'm about to show you you're gonna get a black screen Microsoft Security Essentials is gonna go out on you but that's not exactly bad because you can download antivirus protection applications and they'll work just as good your system will run fine as a matter of fact I have a system Vista running with an invalid product key which has the black screen and I still can use it to play Roblox and Steam and all those games okay so you're just gonna do this it's gonna follow you through the process all the steps the ISO file will take a while to download and this will take a while to install but as soon as you're booted up into Windows 7 it is your home free but when you get in Windows 7 there's gonna be roughly 200 updates it's gonna need to do and it varies on depends on what your system requirements are like what you had to delete to get Windows 7 but all those updates will update it to your full potential and this is the step I'm going to show you when you're 30 day trial period runs out you're just going to type in cmd you're going to left right click it run as administrator hit yes and you're going to i'm not going to actually enter this but i'm going to type it in for you s l m g r space dash re arm then you're just going to hit enter but you have to make sure you're in administrator mode you're going to hit this you're going to hit enter it's going to tell you to restart your system. You're going to restart it, and you got 30 days. And you can do this a number of times. Some systems uh, have a limit to them, which is like a rough estimate of 3 to 5. Other systems do not have limits on them, but it just depends on your system, which I'm not going to enter this because I've just done this. So good luck with this. It works for me 100% working. I didn't pay a single penny for it. It's amazing. So 
I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Watch more videos by me. Thank you.